And then right next to that, number three or four, we have these and darker shadows. They're not blended together. They're like, this is the only time I'm going to tell you not to blend. You can see that there's some separation between two. It's not a nice gradient. And bring that shadow right behind the boat and then get lighter as you approach the land. So over here, I think that there's like too much of a diagonal line going over here. So I'm gonna just like have some like darkness right into the other side. Straight and try to make it like wobbly. Don't make it super straight. Once you're done with that, with this all this whole empty gap here, we're just gonna create really like strokes to kind of combine the two together. So just don't rush this. If you rush it, it'll look like scribbles. Just like for so a tip I would give is so for the part that I did scribble and I have peaks sticking out so like this this and this I would extend that peak to the other side and get lighter so that's what I'm doing and then same over here here's a little peak here peak 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 I'm just gonna extend that I'm not just picking any peak Basically done with all of this. Now we can move on to this part. This part is actually the easiest part. So I made sure we finished the first part first. So same what we did with that shadow going down. We're gonna do it in between these tiny ships. Because they're so tiny, we don't have to do any details. Just go down and then 